try your scheme. And most people were caught, they were found guilty. Most people were caught in the previous season because they were found guilty. Some people actually gave up the ghosts. Some people gave up some businesses. Things crumbled. People lost their money. People uh, lost their homes. Things just happened so bad in the previous season. Some people were caught up in that moment of judgment, the moment that God was testing everyone on the surface of the earth, the moment, the moment that God was testing works, some things actually crumbled below there. And you are still standing. You are still standing. You are still alive. Some people actually died in the previous season. This has been a very, very tough season. A lot of people have died this season, beloved, because they could not withstand it. The pressure was too much. The tension was too much. The demands was, it was too much. The witchcraft of the spirit was too much. A lot was going on in the previous season. People lost things. Oh, my God. Most of you have gone through so much recently. It's because God was God allowed those things, the spirit, to test some people if they if they pass the test. God tested perhaps your work, your vision, your career, your marriage, your finances. Some of you, there was there, there was that shaking things. The furniture, your furniture was shaken. Your security was tempered with things. Your life really was things. Your life went a certain way, certain direction that you could not even you could not even understand, you could not even like interpret what was actually going on. God was testing works. God was trying people. And to God be the glory, you pass the test. You pass the test. First Corinthians 3 verse 13. Their works will be shown for what it is because the day will break it to break it to light. It will be revealed with fire. And the fire will test the quality of each person's work. Oh my God. Fire came and tested your, your commitment to the Lord, your obedience to the Lord, your honesty, your faithfulness. You were being tried in the previous season, beloved. And not only were you being tried in the previous season, some things that you had in your life going were tempered with. But God said you passed the test. The fact that you were not being consumed, the fact that you, were not, you did not perish, the fact that you didn't give up is a big sign that, my God, you passed the test. You passed the test. Hallelujah. You passed the test. That is win. The east wind that blew, hallelujah, the east wind that passed across could not completely destroy you. That's a sign that you've passed the test in Jesus' mighty name. God says congratulations for arriving the new season. Yes, it's another season for God's grace to keep manifesting. It's another season for God's light, for God's power, for God's victory to keep being prevailing in the name of Jesus. Let's, yes, works were being tested. People's intentions were being tested. Hearts were being, were, were being tested. Things in your life were being tested, but you passed a test. You pass a test. Glory to God. May the Lord continue to strengthen you so that the next the next thing you're going to continue passing tests. Test upon test upon test upon test in Jesus' mighty name. God said that a lot of people, like if you if you observe critically, this is a lot of people actually died. People gave up this season. A lot happened this season. Things shattered. I mean the previous season. Things like so much went wrong. People were lamenting in silence. People were, some people were actually, like, people actually gave some, their, out, their voices out while they were crying and everything. But it was a season of hmm, the good, the bad, and the ugly. But for the most part of it, some things were being tempered with. Some of you, they stole from you. They lied. They betrayed you. They backstabbed you. They humiliated you. Some of you, they rendered you homeless. Some of you, they, they disappointed you. Oh, a lot, a lot went on the previous season. It was really tough. It was really, really so tough. But God is saying to this moment that it's a new dawn. It's another moment for you to calm down, calm down, relax, relax. God is with you. He's going to contribute with being with you. Always and always in Jesus' mighty name. Faith is our vehicle and love is our strength. See you in the next video. Hallelujah.